Welcome to Turtle Hill Golf Club at Fairmont Southampton. Uh, I would like to introduce our special guest professionals, uh, Chip Beck, Barry Lane, Mark Mooland, Lindsay Knowlton, Samantha Head and Christine Langford. Thank you for coming. As well as everyone else. Uh, we have a record field uh, this year with, over, uh, with 156 players, over 120 from overseas from seven different countries, some from as far away as Thailand um, and Brazil. Uh, the event has grown into a signature event for Bermuda Golf and in keeping with Fairmont Southampton's long-term golf to tourism strategy, uh, this event has gone from strength to strength. Um, I would like now to thank all our sponsors and partners, um, foremost Bacardi Limited, uh, the Bermuda Tourism Authority, uh, British Airways, Coca-Cola, Rayclan, Cell One, Cleveland Strixon, PGA Canada and Bermuda Tees. Um, thank you very much. I'd like to introduce Jeff Diamond from the PGA Canada. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thanks, Paul. And uh, what phenomenal numbers you just shared there with this uh, an event, this field, of the quality field that we have here, the field size we have, and the diversity we have as well. It's pretty much an event that is like no other around the whole entire world. And uh, to see these players we have here, along with the other 143 that are with us, uh, it should be a fantastic week. We're very proud to play our small part uh, from the PGA of Canada, alongside our friends Paul and Shelley and uh, Andrew Brooks at Bruno Tourism. The amount of emails that go on between uh, about January until now are unbelievable, and the plan is, uh, is to keep it uh, rolling for you this week. The sponsor, Grey Goose, uh, who wouldn't love to have a sponsor like this? And look around you with the hotel like this, the golf course, the sponsor. Uh, it's a perfect storm for a perfect event, and uh, we're happy to be here. So, um, again, thanks for having us. If you need anything, come find myself or Chris or Adam from the PGA, and we will do whatever we can to make your event uh, even better. So, again, thanks so much, and we'll see you uh, this week. Love to. Uh, my name is uh, Christine Langford. I'm a member of the Ladies European Tour, founder member of the Ladies European Tour, which makes me a very old professional indeed. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm delighted to be uh, back in Bermuda. I, I come here quite a bit with uh, golf groups. It's the most fantastic place to, uh, to bring British uh, golfing tourists, uh, and it's great to have an opportunity to come back uh, this time with my clubs. I hope I'm saying that in two days' time, though. Thank you. Uh, I'm Samantha Head. Um, I've played played on the European Tour for 15 years. I won twice on the European Tour. Uh, I'm now co coaching in the UK, doing my PGA training. I've uh, come out to Bermuda with my family, so my mum and my daughter are here. They're meant to be at the press conference, but they've obviously decided to stay at the beach. Um, we, we've never been here before, so it's an absolute pleasure to be here. It's the most beautiful place. Um, and I can't wait to get on the beach this afternoon. And the golf course is, is a lot tougher than I thought it would be. I've been practicing sort of short irons over the winter. I didn't realize I'd need my driver a few times. <laughs> so um, it's going to be tough out there for, for us ladies. But um, really looking forward to it. And hopefully uh, we can do quite well. Thank you. Hello, my name is Lindsay Knowlton. I am from Toronto, Canada. This is my first time here in Bermuda and I've heard from many people before that it's a magical place and they were bang on. This is, it's absolutely incredible. Um, I played golf for the Ohio State University in college and then three years on the Canadian national team. And since then I've founded a company called Iron Lady Golf that helps women learn how to play golf and get into the game. So I'm excited to be here, excited to be a part of it. Uh, Par three course is a little deceiving because it's it's more than a par three. The greens are incredible. Uh, the course is going to be a lot of fun, especially if the wind gets blowing. And I'm looking forward to having some fun and competing against these great folks. Hi there, I'm Mark Millen from Wales. Uh, this is my third time here, and um, after 35 years of travelling the world playing in events. Uh, I certainly look forward to coming back to this beautiful island every year. It really is special. The course is special and, and also the course this year I think is in the best present, uh, presentation I've seen uh, in the last three years. The greens running around 11 on the stint meter which is uh, right up with, a, uh, with the best of the greens that we play on. And uh, I hope the weather stays fine like this and look forward to a good week. Thank you. Hello, my name is Barry Lane. Uh, I played on the main tour in Europe for 30 years and now play on the seniors tour with the old beer bellies. Um, I think it's 
very poignant of bringing Mr. Chit Beck, who beat me in the Ryder Cup in the single. So I am definitely this week going to beat him. Thank you. I love being here. Say, say that again, Brad. Yeah. 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 <laughs> what did you say? You beat me in the singles in the Ryder Cup. <laughs> well, I beat myself. Yeah, yeah. That's what. That's really what happened. You know, that's what happened. But I'll tell you one thing that's been one of the greatest things in my life is becoming friends with Barry Lane after that. Because, you know, a lot of people, when I was fortunate enough to win, I mean, I think I won like the last four holes or something like that. But when somebody's humble enough, kind enough, and uh, a man enough to take the blows and be your friend, that's more than anything. So I appreciate that, Barry. I really do. I appreciate your friendship. He's been really kind to me. And he's actually helped me with my game, which I really appreciate. So only in golf does that happen. So I'm going to try to beat you again, though. <laughs> we'll see what happens, right? But I was kind of surprised at the golf course as well, because when you think of a par three in America, you think, well, it's a little chip around course, 70 yards here, you know, like we play the Peter Hay at Pebble Beach. And I mean, we have a great time with it, but you play it 60 yards is the longest hole, maybe 80 yards. But here I hit three wood to one of the holes. It was, you know, 226 yards to the flag today. So it's quite a challenge. And it looks like there's a lot of peeling off that you catch a bank, it could carry them into the water. So you can make some pretty good numbers here. But I, I will say that the greens are as good as I've ever seen anywhere. And as good as any course I've ever played in Florida, that's for sure. And that's our best greens at this time of year. So I'm looking forward to it. Thanks for having me, Paul, and uh, the PJ of Canada. Um, it's really nice that you're involved. Shelly, thanks for having me with Grey Goose. God bless you all. And we're going to have a fun week. I look forward to that, sh uh, that ferry tonight. <laughs>